What's going on, Fish Family? This is Roberto with RLC Aquatics, and I appreciate you guys joining my channel. If you are new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I don't want you guys to miss anything, so also make sure you guys hit the post notification bells, and let's shoot for 50 likes in this video, man. Please hit the like button. It does make the channel grow, and it does help it drastically. All right, so now that we got that blah, blah, blah out the way, let's go to the backyard. I want to show you guys what I got going on. Let's get this moving already. All right, as you guys remember, we are going to put the tubs on top of that box spring right there. Actually, I'm going to throw that away. I'm not even going to worry about that. We're going to go ahead and just clean all this up. Um, there's something special that I'm going to go ahead and prep this area for. But we need to get this organized. Like, I really need to take care of this. Um, I, the Pilates are gone. The, I, the colony of Pilates, they are finito. I went ahead and sold the whole colony. Um, those needed to be out the way. I'm, I, I had fun with them, but I'm really wanting to focus on what I'm, you know, basically uh doing on the backyard is breeding mainly the fancy guppies and other uh, more rare strains i want to keep totes and tubs and um, aquariums i want to keep them specifically only for you know uh nothing common i don't want anything common in the uh you know in in my possession so i just want to go ahead and let you guys know the update on that but i want to go ahead and let's just get this cleaned up man this is really uh, giving me anxiety I want to go ahead and I'm trying to figure out how I want to organize these tubs and these containers and uh, we're going to go ahead and figure some things out and let's just do that right now all right so after a bunch of organizing after a bunch of moving things around I think I'm going to go with this right here and I think I'm going to actually just carry it along here the same method I think I'll just have this one here just a, another station right there so I have two sort of two guppy stations but right now we're just going to be focusing on this particular guppy station i have five different containers as you guys know if you haven't seen the video right there the five different strains that i want in 2022 this is why boom got the housing let's get the water in it we are making moves people All right, so we got the water in these two containers. See, this is this is what I'm talking about, guys. This is what I'm talking about. This oak tree is roofless, man. Please, in the comments below, uh, I'm thinking about maybe building like a, a shelter uh, with like a screen over it. Maybe I'm not too sure, man. I'm, that's I, I'm, actually that's what we're gonna be doing in this video too. We're gonna be going to Home Depot and Lowe's just to see what they got, man. Um, I'm not going to put the water in this in these containers just yet. I had an idea with some wood that I have. I want to um, stabilize that some way. I'm not sure. I don't know. I think that would be good. But um, got the water in these two containers. But leave a comment below, man. What what? I need a little container or uh, a shelter. Sh something to, uh, if you guys could see this roofless ass, this oak tree, man. It's just, you know. Um, I'm actually going to take apart that and save the wood because uh, I'm going to be doing some things with the wood there. And actually, I might even be able to use that wood, stake it to the ground, right, for corners and then uh, kind of develop some kind of shelter. I don't know. Uh, but these oak tree leaves, man, are no bueno. So leave a comment below, man. What would you do? What would you do? I need I need something something cheap and simple. All right, this is what I was talking about. Just in case it's too much weight. Put one like that. I'm going to put the other one right here. Yes, sir. Just to give it a little bit, of, you know, in case that middle one bows have some stabilization all right okay. it's about even there all right all right so all better i know it's bothering you guys having the two blue ones like that so kind of color coordinated it black blue on the side let's go all right, I'm here at Lowe's. If you guys are wondering where I got the totes at, it's the heavy duty containers. $11, $12. I just like them because they're durable, man. Like, you know, they're super hardy. 
and you don't have to worry about if you have direct sunlight you don't have to worry about them so yeah a couple dollars more get yourself the heavy duty oh i always love to stop at this area let's see let's see i might grab Then you can attach this. Pretty dope, pretty dope. Guys, this is not bad. $300, this is a heavy duty one too, man. You know, has the steel racks, $299. Huh. Okay, okay. It's the smaller ones here. These are the ones that normally people grab. Okay, okay, okay. All right, guys, we can even do something like this with the screen. You know what I mean? Put it right on top of the uh, of the circular containers. You know what I mean? Eight dollars and it comes, looks like you get two of them, man. Like, I don't know, we could do that. Or we could do one of these numbers, you know, and then 16 bucks. This is a little bit more thinner here. Excuse my dirty thumb. But yeah. Getting some ideas, man. Getting some ideas, cause we could we could do something along the lines of making like a wooden shell or something, and then stapling it on to the wood. I don't know. I gotta think of something soon, but that's good. That's good. I got the idea now. We can honestly, and they have it by the big rolls too. But yeah. We might, uh, we might be onto something. We might be onto something. Or, right. see the leaves won't get through this. Or will they? Huh. All right. That's about what we need. And then, so what we do is we just dig up to like around, maybe dig up to right here and put some concrete in the hole then I'll have all that and then maybe we could uh staple you know I don't know we'll, we'll see what happens but staple the screen on the top here and develop some kind of structure on the top and then just staple the screen all along the wood we'll see we'll see ideas all right so as you guys can see we got a little bit of work to do if you guys have any suggestions please leave a comment below man i really want to get this section organized i don't want it to be mickey mouse i want it to be like half ass i really want to do a good job on it so please leave your suggestions with any comments you have i want to show to that area man i want to prevent the leaves from going in these containers uh the sun doesn't really hit the the backyard as much so it's really not so much for the shade uh but i want to prevent those leaves from going into the tubs uh, what else we need to uh, we need to build a little box for the air pump just so the air pop pump doesn't get wet out there um we got to start ordering guppies man i want to get those those uh those tubs out there cycled i want them to ready to go i right, i think the first strain that i'm going to order would be the platinum uh red dumbo um fish if i'm not mistaken i want to get those first so as uh it's looking right now unless something changes i will be ordering the platinum red dumbo um fish so the guppies just to let you guys know that so that will be the first strain we're bringing in here and i'll do the unboxing video on that of course but yeah man we're just really trying to get the backyard prepped we're trying to get a head start on things this year i want to get everything going i want to start pumping these fish out i want to start breeding these strains and you know i want to start uh making mistakes and failing man that's the only way we're going to learn right but I appreciate you guys, as always. In the next video, we're going to get more in-depth. Maybe putting the heaters in the back, uh, getting everything into the actual tubs as far as the maybe hornwort, uh, 
the guppy grass, anything, you know, along those lines for the cover for, for the fry. And uh, yeah, you're going to take this day by day. I'm going to be pumping out a lot of videos, guys. So make sure you got your no notifications bell on. As always, I love you guys. Stay positive because being negative is a disease. Peace.